Hi everyone, I hope you're doing well. This week is about celebrating all the hard work that you've done this year as we move into summer. So I thought we could make a fun flower garden crown to celebrate all your hard work and summer. So to make this crown, you're going to need paper. You can use green paper like I used, or you can use white paper that you could color green. You're also going to need scissors, glue, and something to decorate your crown with, such as crayons or markers. Okay, let's get started on making your crown. Our first step is to fold our paper in half, and we're going to fold it the long way like a hot dog. You want to really push down to make a good crease. Now our next step is to draw a line so we know exactly where to cut. Remember we hold our crayon with our thumb, index, and middle finger. And we can hide our treasure so our pinky and ring finger are tucked in. Next you're going to draw a line on your crease. Now get your scissors ready. Remember two fingers on the bottom and thumb on top. Open and close, chomp, chomp, chomp. One hand holds the paper and the other cuts. We're gonna cut across that line to make two pieces of paper. So next you need to make grass on your paper. So you can use your crayon or marker to make some lines on the top of the paper so you know where you need to cut. Or if you prefer, you can just use your scissors to freehand what you need to do. So we're gonna have two fingers on the bottom and thumb on top. Open and close, chomp, chomp, chomp. And you're gonna make your grass. You can make different size grass, so you could make some big pieces or little pieces, because remember, grass is all different sizes. So you just wanna keep on going until you cut both pieces of paper on the top to make your grass. Next, you're gonna take glue and you're gonna glue your two pieces of paper together to make the crown. Remember, when we're gluing, we dot, dot, but not a lot. And it's okay if we get glue on our fingers because we can wash our hands when we're done. So make sure you push down and connect your crown. So next, you're gonna get your crayons, and I'm gonna show you, here's our grip and flip. We grip with our thumb, index, and middle, and flip around and hide our treasure so we can make some flowers. So to make a flower, I drew a circle and then I drew curved lines around the flower. And then I color in my flower. I'm really careful to color, 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 stay in the lines, stay in the lines. So I'm using my fingers to color in my flower while my one hand holds the paper and the other colors. I'm gonna just change the color to color the center yellow. And then I'll keep going and making a lot of different flowers. So you can use your favorite colors to make a pretty flower garden for your crown. You can use lots of colors on your flowers or just one or two. It's all up to you. So you wanna keep on going until you finish your whole garden of colors and make sure that you're using your thumb, index, and middle finger while you're coloring. And make sure your other hand's holding the paper while you color. Ta-da! You made a beautiful garden of flowers. Look at those beautiful flowers you made. Now that you've decorated your crown, the last step is to measure and glue. So you're gonna probably need an adult to help you with this step. We're gonna put the crown around your head. You wanna make sure it's straight. And you're gonna find how tight you need to make it so that it'll stay on your head. So you may need to trim your crown so you know where you need to put your glue. Or just remember. Then we're gonna take our glue, we're gonna dot dot, but not a lot. We're gonna bring the other side of our crown over and we're going to push and pinch our crown so it stays together. 
I had so much fun making a crown with you, and I hope you had fun too. Please feel free to send me pictures or videos of you making a flower crown. And once again, we're celebrating all the hard work that you have done this year. I look forward to talking to you soon. Bye.